Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to teach you how you can install the G++ compiler for Windows which we can use to compile the C++ programs and uh, for this let's move on my computer screen. Let's go. So guys to install the G++ compiler actually we have to install the min gw so after installing this we can use the gcc or the G++ compiler. So how we can install this you have to go on this website. I will share the link of this website in the description so you can go get the link from there there are some prerequisites you have to install the visual studio code and you have to install the c++ extension for the visual studio code and i have already done these steps and the next step is we have to install this uh, program called msys2 which is called the min gw and uh, over operating system is 64 so i will open this link here and uh, after this to install this i have to click on this and it will download a file for me and i will open this and we have to just click on next 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 and it will take some time so uh, we are going to finish it or we have to install the 64 bit of this compiler toolchain and to install the toolchain you have to copy this command and run it in the 64 bit msys2 so for this you can press the windows key and type msys and you have to find the 64 bit and it is here ming gw64 and you have to run as an administrator and copy and paste this toolchain command here and press enter so it will install all the toolchain for you and you have to install default all you have to just press enter for the default and press y so it will install all the tool chains for you uh, so as the installation is successful and uh, all the 58 components and the tools are installed successfully and so i have to clone this close this ming gw terminal so we will move on to the next step we just left with one step and uh, it is saying that add uh, path to your ming 64 bin folder to the path environment variable and uh, it should be here so we can copy this path and uh, we will open the environment variables system environment variables and we have to copy this in the path here and uh, just click new and paste it here and press enter and ok and ok and ok so after this you have to open the new terminal from the cmd and if i open the new terminal cmd and uh, type g++ as you can see now it is recognized the command but we have to pass this over c++ files here to compile the program successfully so for example here is the example program it will just print hello world so we will compile this program so it's in my c directory and it's called bug example and i will just type g++ and the name for my cpp file and minus o and output file so as you can see now this command is successful and uh, an output file is generated and if I run my output file so it will print hello world. Uh, this is it for today so if you like my videos you can subscribe my channel and also press the bell icon to get the updates of the new uploads so see you next time bye bye.